Hi, welcome to another video of Enter Swift. With Enter Swift, you learn the fundamentals of Swift using Swift UI. In this video, I'll show you how you can make the variable you define in a struct mutable. This example tracks the number of login attempts when we tap on a button. So you can see here, I have defined a constant maximum number of login attempts with an initial value of 10. Then we have a variable current login attempt defined with an initial value. So our intention is to tap on a button to update the current login attempts. So we have defined it here as a variable so we can change it when we tap on the button. So over here you can see I have created a button and use an if statement. So if the current login attempt is less than the maximum login attempt, that is 10, we increase the current login attempt by one. The compiler is complaining about the variable defined over here not being mutable. Mutable meaning it can be changed. But when it is immutable, it cannot be changed. A constant is immutable, it cannot be changed. So when we define a variable inside a struct in Swift UI, it behaves as if it is a constant. So this variable we have defined here cannot be changed. To make this mutable, we need to use the property wrapper at state. So when we define this variable with the at state property wrapper, what we are saying is to make it changeable. So let's add it here. So you can now see the error has disappeared. And anytime we tap on the button, we increase the current login attempts until it reaches the maximum. So this is how to make a variable we define in a Swift UI struct mutable so that you can change it later. Thanks for watching this video.